Hey guys, for I just let you know some cool stuff that Samsung is going to do pretty soon here next week and that is that they're going to show off a new LCD, a very ultra sharp LCD and it's optimized for tablets and you may think, hmm, okay so we have the iPad 2 there, it's wonderful got this uh, wonderful resolution, pretty low, you know, not retina but it's still pretty good nah, it's not, it's not that good, I mean, it's not that good, it's like 1024 times something 900 something like that it's 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 pretty bad pretty bad resolution for a 10 inch display basically what Samsung is going to show off is going to be a display for tablets it is called a Penta RGBW don't confuse this with like something that Samsung is doing with the Super AMOLED it's nothing like that RGBW stands for red, green, blue and white screen and basically the resolution now relax is 2560 times 1600 1600 2560 times 1600 300 pixels per inch you can compare that to the iPhone 4 that have a retina display and do you know why the... no, I mean the iPhone 4 that have this retina display but do you know why Apple didn't include that on the iPad 2 display? well that's because the retina display it costs money and you get pretty good quality and I mean it, it's going to be cost more and I mean if we compare this resolution 2560 times 600, 1600 against uh, the resolution on let's say the Motorola Zoom that have it 1280 times 800 I mean that is, that is like two times sharper I mean the iPad 2 it's uh, pixels per inch is 132 this bad boy here is going to be 300 ppi so two times sharper uh, and more, a little more than two times sharper, but still, it is insane. This Pentel ultra sharp technology, and it's going to be quite insane. Also, what they said was more detailed technical stuff. I don't think that you care that much about it, but basically, they were you know teasing us that they could already start to ship products before the end of this year that is going to have you know a retina display. A 10 inch tablet, the first tablet with a retina display. That is going to be insane, but you should also remember that if something released a hardware, then obviously it's going to take some time to manufacture that and you know put it in a tablet and stuff like that. So we may not see a retina tablet or retina like tablet before you know early 2012, but still. I'm looking forward to this. Also, I mean, this is going to you need a lot of more battery power. Also, you know, we may require some quad core processor, but hey, the quad core processors are coming to tablets, so probably we are going to see some kind of quad core tablet here by the end of 2011, hopefully with a retina display. I mean, it does sound like the iPad 3, and if the iPad 3 is going to have a quad core plus a retina display plus some other cool high tech stuff, I'm going to buy that device. I don't care what it costs, it's going to be epic, so that's sweet. So look forward to that. See you.